Hello and thank you for listening to this tutorial on creating a budget in QuickBooks. Creating a budget in QuickBooks is very simple. Um, you can create a budget from scratch or create a budget based on previous year's actuals. Um, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create a budget based on previous years, actuals, and then show you how to edit that budget um, and then show you some reports um, relating to the budget functionality within QuickBooks. Um, but to create a budget you go to company, planning, and budgeting and then set up budgets. Um, there's already a budget out here but we're going to create, there's one out here, profit and loss by account and class, but we're going to create a new budget. Um, we're going to base this budget, it's going to be a profit and loss budget. You also have the option of creating a budget for your balance sheet. Um, we're going to create this budget based on our um, fiscal year 2018 to 2019. Um, you have an option of no additional criteria, which will just give you the income and expense accounts budget if you're doing a profit and loss budget, so it allow you to create a budget just based on your income and expense accounts. Um, you can do the same but by customer and job or by class. In this example we're going to do it by class. Um, and here's where you have the option of creating a budget from scratch. And this basically allows you to just manually enter your budget amounts. Um, but we're going to create a budget from previous year's actual data. So select that and then click finish and then you will see that we've created a budget based on for next year in this example 2018 to 2019 based on 2017-2018 actual data. Um, you can see that this is currently displaying the design class but we can select landscape class or maintenance class. Basically you can view the budget based on your actual data from prior year. It, it populated a budget um, um, for each account and class. Um, you can go in and manually update. For example, you know that in February you're going to have a spike um, in your fountains and gardens materials so we want to make this 2500 you just simply click on it and it changes the amount that you want to budget you can also put an amount in a column for example um, you expect to this year spend 2500 each month um, so you could put 2500 dollars in a column and then select the copy across function and that will copy that same amount all the way across um, for each month. Um, you can also select to adjust each amount um, in that line by selecting adjust a row. You can say you can adjust for um, the first month or current selected month only but we're going to say for the first month on and we want to increase the monthly amount um, by 1.5 percent. We just anticipate that we are going to spend a little more this month than last month or you can decrease um, by a percentage also. And, and then if you click OK you will see that it increased each month by that 1.5 um, percent. Um, once you've set up your budget you can just hit um, Sorry, I didn't mean to go into that. Once you've got all your budget numbers aligned by class, just click Save um, and then OK. Next, you can run some reports. I'll show you some. Um, all your reports are um, organized here in the Budgets and Forecast section. You could do a Budgets Overview, a Budgets versus Actual, um, or a um, Budgets versus Actual Graph. Um, I will talk about forecasts later, but basically the difference between a forecast and a budget is a forecast is a projection of what you expect to spend 
in the future and a budget is more current next year how a guide for your current year um, spend um, but to show you a budget versus actual report you just simply click on the report these are um, delivered reports then you select the budget that we created and we created a profit and loss by account class budget click next and finish and you will see a report that shows your budget versus actuals for the budget period that you selected. Um, there are a lot of functionality and a lot of uh, useful tools in the QuickBooks budget creation tool. Um, as always, if you have any additional questions, feel free to give us a call. Thank you.